so hey youtube we back with another video um today it's just gonna be kind of something simple i um uh, i'm gonna be unboxing some samples and the samples is the same thing that i was taking pictures of last time basically the shorts or whatever so i just pulled up to my mama house but i'm still in the car because i'm gonna try to give y'all like a quick little rundown or whatever so you can kind of understand what's going on um so so yeah y'all seen the shorts that i was um taking pictures of last video so those were samples of course so what i normally do is um i get samples from like maybe two to three different manufacturers honestly it depends on like how complicated the product is that i'm trying to release and the shorts kind of had a lot of a lot of detail like it had the um puff print and then it had the uh embroidery the little patch on the leg and then it had um rhinestones on them so for some manufacturers I'm, i mean it's not it's simple work to me it is but sometimes it could be a lot for some manufacturers so and i want them to be right like perfect for real so i got the shorts made by three different manufacturers so i had them like picked out like one through three like who i thought was going to be the best the second best third best so um the third best she ended up she she was informing me kind of along the way or whatever but um when she actually sent me a picture of the finished product like that shit was not it y'all that shit was not it like i'm like yeah um i don't even, i don't want them no more and then she was really trying to make me like before she even like so i paid like half up front half for the um rest whenever she finished but like she was on some shit to where she just wanted me to go ahead and place the bulk order when she showed me a picture of the samples and then like she take money off of the bulk order or whatever like even if i was or did want her to send the samples she wasn't trying to do it like that so i'm like okay i don't even want the shit anyway to be honest with you like so the second guy who i'm thinking is second best or whatever he um he sent his first and like i said that's who i was taking a picture of whatever and he actually like he did a good job like i like i really like his shorts the only thing that i want to change on them is um i want longer strings and then probably just a little bit more rhinestones like just a little bit i don't want to overdo it with the shorts but just a little bit so other than that that was really like his was good so i was really thinking about going with him to do the book order and um the first guy who I thought was going to be the best or whatever, that's who samples just came today. So, I got to share that with y'all. You know, y'all unbox the samples with me or whatever. So, that's what we're about to do. Um, So, yeah. But anytime y'all are trying to get product or, you know, trying to get prepared for a drop, y'all have to get samples. Like, I was doing it wrong when I first started. Thank God. Like, it, it kind of did backfire, actually. But... Yeah, that's another story. It did backfire, but I I end up still actually I didn't sell none of the product. But yeah, that's the story for another day. But um but yeah, uh so for me like it's still cold as hell outside. Like all right, hold on, it's like fifty degrees here right now, like you know, in Texas or whatever. But I'm doing shorts, right? So since I do pre made, you know, I don't do pre order, so I have to already like be more on top of my drops because if I don't like I can easily start being like a season behind so like I have to then stay a season ahead so it can drop the way that I want it to drop or whatever so y'all still know yeah I have the sweatsuits dropping 25th this month January I talked to the manufacturer today he said he'll be shipping them out I know I told y'all last video he talking about this coming week. I told y'all that shit wasn't gonna work. So he said Tuesday for sure because of the holidays. Like, okay, that's cool. I'm not tripping on that. And um, so yeah, still as soon as those come, I'm gonna show y'all, you know, what I got. And then um, think about for all my subscribers, a little VIP list I got. I'm gonna drop something special for y'all next month. It's gonna be. I always say drops is limited, but this one, like, I'm telling you, like. It, that's why it's really gonna be just for the VIP list because I don't I don't have a lot. If I do it, I'm trying to do it. It's gonna be a surprise, so y'all see it. And um, if I do it, who knows? So 
that's February, and then March, that's what I'm working on now, like, getting the samples in. So, I like dude samples. I was taking pictures the other day. If I like these samples that's in the house, I'm going to go ahead and place the book, you know? So, those can be getting made. I'll probably get those in in February, stay on top of it, move on to the next month after that. I don't really know. I do know. I do know what I'm trying to cook up for April, kind of, sort of, so... We gonna see y'all like I got a lot of stuff though like I'm telling y'all like y'all gonna like it I promise and, and like I said I I gotta stay ahead of myself and make sure I keep stuff coming because well and early keep it coming early because I don't want to do no pre-orders with y'all like y'all love the fact I tell people tell me that all the time like I love the fact that you ship next day like and the stuff is hard too like y'all told y'all y'all order on a Monday. Shit, y'all might have that shit by Thursday, Friday. For real, like, have that shit in your hands. So, yeah, I got a lot of stuff that I'm working on in 2024, just trying to get better with the whole process. Um, My packaging is definitely going to get better. Like, I was really on some beginner shit with the packaging, just putting the shit in the bag. I didn't have no custom bags, no none of that. But I still appreciate the people who did shop with me, you know, um... That was definitely a blessing, like, to just have people, you know, buy from you, purchase your stuff, stuff that you make come to life, you know. And um, I got to, like, kind of, you know, do better for y'all. So not only, like, quality and everything getting better, packaging, you know, I did the stickers and added some keychains and everything. So I'm, um, I'm working on it. I'm getting a little better or whatever. I am. You know, I do all this by myself. So sometimes, and I still work every day. 7 or well, 6.30 to 3. So, and then my son, he, y'all know him from last video, bad as hell. He in the house right now, so he probably going to be in the in the room while I'm doing this, um, unboxing the sample or whatever, because he be stuck to my help, y'all, I'm telling you. So, I be having a lot going on, but I make it work. I make it work, so that's all that matters. But, yeah, so I'm about to go in here and get this sample ready to unpackage. See y'all in a little bit. All right, y'all. So it's a little package or whatever. The short center is about four over. Look what I told y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all what that is. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, y'all. What I see so far, I think they hard. I think they hard. Let's see. Let's see. Y'all know them blues, my one. My favorites. See. And he understood the assignment, though. Like, you see the string? That's what I was saying. I don't know what the string I don't even know what size it is. I think I, I like them. I don't know. They're kind of big, though. But they, what y'all think? I don't know, y'all. I think she... I like him. I like him. I think dude, the other one has like better puff print. <laughs> but I like the quality of his shorts though, you know? Uh oh. Uh oh, you hear him? It's the black and red one. They really look the same. The only difference I will say. They also, they both are good. It's just a little thicker. But I did t I did tell him to up the uh GSM a little bit. Yeah, like let me see if I can see. The puff print. His puff print cool. I think the other dude was a little bit. I'm going to show y'all though. I'm going to show y'all. He did. Hey. I, he did good though. See, it's good to have two manufacturers that. They're doing good. Man. And what? Great boys. I 
did his thing. This thing. Red. Yep, mommy. Yep, yep. yep. Alright, so. Let's hit a puff print. It's cool. The gray ones. Blue always my favorite. I do like how he did that blue, like that's a pretty blue. And then the black ones. I mean, overall, I think they're cool though. I think they're cool. Like, I think I'm gonna drop these shorts again in the kids and kids or whatever. Look at look at that. See all his toys there. Just do whatever he want. My mama got this room just for him. But um, but yeah, so I think I'm gonna drop some kids, and I'll probably go to him to get the kids made, okay? But yeah, I think they both did a good job. I think they both did a good job. So. I still don't know who exactly I'm. Gonna, still don't know who exactly I'm gonna go with, but um. We're going to see. So, yeah, I just wanted to show y'all some samples or whatever. Kind of go into detail a little bit about what you got to do when you're trying to prepare for a drop. Then you have options, you know. And you can be in a position like me. You can have two good manufacturers. And they both cost the same. Like, I paid the exact same for these shorts. Like, okay, another thing before we go. When you get a sample made from a manufacturer... Make sure you're asking them everything as if you would when you're getting a bulk order. So, like, when I go to a manufacturer and I, I ask them first, how much for the samples? You get the four colorways. Then I ask them um, how much for a bulk order of whatever I'm planning on getting. Because you got to know, like, if he charge you a certain amount for some samples, and then you're like, okay, cool, I like the samples, and then you start doing business with about the bulk order, and it's like right out of your price range or something you're not trying to do. You done wasted your time even getting samples. So you kind of got to ask these questions already. So make sure you asking them how much for a bulk order of whatever you're trying to get before and before you get the samples. You got to know the MOQs, minimum order quantity. Look, I done forgot. I almost forgot what I meant. Excuse me. And, um, But yeah, so the position I'm in is a good position to be in because I really don't know who I'm going to go with. But I honestly think the ones I showed y'all the other day, I do think the only reason I'm leaning more towards him is because things like this matter also. The communication, y'all. Like, this dude is what? Is it January? What's today? Like the 5th or something like that, I think. So, I think it's the 5th. All right, look. See, he wanted to be picked up. But, um, <coughs> yeah. Nasty. <laughs> so, um, baby, you was heavy. You making me a little strength out. But yeah, anyway. So, uh, damn, what was I for to say? Um, oh, the communication, y'all. Like, he was supposed to finish these. He told me I was gonna have them before Christmas, like the sixteenth or seventeenth. As you can see, but I can't put you down. Okay, let's sit down, cause y'all, I cannot hold him. Let's stand up. And as you see, I just got him today. And it's not too bad. You know, it's not bad enough to where I won't deal with him no more. But one thing that I stress to manufacturers, listen, be honest with me. Don't tell me a certain day and then it be like other days. Like, I'm understandable. Like, I know you're running a business. Just tell me what it is. That way I can prepare my business the right way on my end. Because when y'all lying to me, forcing me to, you know, believe certain things and it's not what it is. That made me look bad to my customers. But, yeah, I done fired a manufacturer for that before. I'm not dealing with him no more. So, he know who he is. Anyway. So, yeah, y'all. Um, Y'all make sure y'all know what you're paying for. How much is going to be all that before you get those samples in. And avoid. Stop. He's saying all in my hair. 
So, yeah. All right, but yeah, I may actually, I don't know, because I told you I was going to pick up the camera last video, and I didn't. We got home, like, just way too late. So, I had just ended up posting the video. But, um, so I may come back and show y'all what I mean with the shorts. Because, oh, yeah, the only reason why I'm leaning more towards the other shorts, regardless, other than the conversation or the communication or whatever, is because <clears throat> I just like the, um, the quality of the puff print, you know what I'm saying? Like, that was real big to me. Oh, my goodness. Come on, get down. So, you're not going to get down? <sighs> yeah. That was real big to me, y'all. The quality of the puff print. I'm supposed to get you. <sighs> so, yeah. And the... Trying to make... I like how thick they are. So, I can easily tell him, you know, make them a little bit thicker. You know? That's, that's simple. That's a simple fix. So, so, yeah. So, y'all, yeah, I may be just going with the second guy. And the style of the shorts. Like, I just, I think y'all would like those better. I'm just being completely honest about what I see, like, my nephews and stuff. With. These look good. Don't get me wrong. Like I said, i definitely go to him again. But I just, I may pick back up the camera tonight, whatever, and get to the house. I don't know yet, but in case I don't pick back up the camera, y'all make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? I got to get them subscribers up, but it don't even matter. I can keep two or three subscribers for the whole year. I'm going to still post content. Hey, I'm talking. I'm talking. Anyways. I'm going to still post content for the whole year because it's going to be somebody that, you know, my journey, my story help. And so, that's all that matters, y'all. So, yeah, y'all make sure y'all go like, comment, subscribe, all that. And uh, I'll see y'all next time.